Welcome back everyone, I hope you're having an awesome day, and today we're going to continue on our El Cid campaign on hard. Uh, last mission we took Toledo for the Christian King Alfonso, and now we're going to be exiled by the Christian King Alfonso. Very rude, pretty typical if you ask me. So make sure to sub, we are doing all the campaigns on hard, uh, I've done all the Age of Kings ones and we're doing all the Conquerors ones now. So sit back, relax, grab your water, because water's good for you, and we'll move on to El Cid 3, the Exile of the Cid. Alfonso sent his most loyal and able servant, Rodrigo Diaz, the Cid, into exile with only his horse, Babieca. Myself and our two daughters were left at the monastery in Castile. And Rodrigo and I parted. It felt like a nail being torn from its finger. Ouch. Rodrigo rode alone into the Castilian winter. He was not alone for long. Everywhere the Cid went, Mercenaries and soldiers were eager to follow. Soon, he had a small army of his own. But the Cid was not content to wander the wilds of Castile forever. He needed a castle and a lord to serve. These two he found in the most unlikely of places. And that's when we... That's when we turn off the Christian to become the... Wait, no, you become... With Saracens in this. All right then. El Cid must find a new city in which to live and a new lord to serve. El Cid must survive. No da. El Cid is restricted to a pop limit of 100. El Cid no longer leads a Spanish army to become familiar with the Saracen tech tree. El Cid does not view Alfonso as an enemy so much as misguided. As such, you should not destroy anything of Alfonso's unless you're forced to. Know when to fight, when to run away. You may need to destroy walls or block your path, but only if there is no other alternative. El Cid starts alone in exile. Do not fear, for you'll soon find recruits to your cause. You'll have little in the way of an economy until you meet up with an old friend. Alfonso is your enemy, but he's more of an annoyance than a threat. The real enemy is Count Baron... What is that name? Baron Guerre of Barcelona. He will send swordsmen, knights, and scorpions, throwing axemen and bat... Wait, what? <laughs> Alright then. And battering rams. Multiply the Moors a potential ally as uh, any other Moors that you may encounter. Right on. Stand you, well, then blind yourself, mate. <laughs> my horse. Here is your horse. Do not judge the king Alfonso too harshly. We will open the gates for you now. Thank you. Godspeed. Hmm. Whatever. Traitors. Traitors to the cause. Well, I suppose that's what happens. So, uh, there's no achievement for this one. Um, I'm doing all the achievements for the campaigns as well, if I remember. Uh, but I think there's only the one in the first mission for uh, the missionary. That's enough of a head start. Whoa! Well, hang on. I do, I'm not even out of the city and you're going to attack me? Alright then, let's go. No, run away. No, don't attack my units. Oi. Oh my goodness. What is this? What is this Amble Scud? Right, let's go, mate. You know what? Let's go. You want to fight? I'll fight you. Right, this is rude. That's a lot of clicking, though. Get him. Those traitors. I lost Pikeman to that. Remember how park when you were useful uh, units? Greetings, my senior. My lord Mohamed has heard of your situation and welcomes you to join him at his city of Zaragoza. It is just a short ride to the southeast of you. To the southeast. All right. I'd... If I've learned anything from this campaign or from this uh, playthrough of all the campaigns, it's that going straight there is not the strategy. If I click that, I'm going to run into some form of... I don't even know what to call it. Some form of uh, resistance that will probably massacre my entire army. I do remember playing El Cid and being like... Uh... I see. King Alfonso has blockaded the gap leading to Zaragoza. 
We are to get through. We must siege his castle. Perhaps okay. we can find the troops we need to the south. To the south, let's go. Well, do I need to fight them though? Or can I just not? I probably need to fight them. Alright, to the south. Let's just go right to the corner, see what happens. My sins, Ooh. What little we have is yours if you can just destroy Alfonso's castle to the north. Wow, they really don't like Alfonso. Radio. Um, we are Saracens, aren't we? We are, so... I have to actually remember camel units. Foot arches of extra attack versus buildings, that doesn't help me at all. Um, let's get three battering rams. I'm gonna get some... we'll get thumb ring. Get a couple of cav arches. We'll get some men at arms as well. I don't want to use all my resources right away, but I do want upgrades and stuff. For example, I don't do I want. As good as I can, I'm gonna get some knights and a camel. Ah, that should do. I mean, I really don't need three rams, but we'll get three rams. Surely that'll do me, right? Three rams should get through not only this, but also that. We will see, I suppose. Uh, but those cav archers are mainly going to be for the... What I'm going to do is we're going to do the old sneaky lure them out with a false sense of security. And then really show them who's boss. Oh, hello. What happened here? Did those archers follow me all the way from this from Alfonso City? Are you kidding me right now? That would actually be kind of funny. I think those archers follow me all the way from Alfonso's King Alfonso's army's the where we started starting location. That's the word I'm looking for. Okay, in theory that should be like all their stuff, right? Like, I don't need to deal with them now. Get him. Alright. Yep, they have gravely mistaken that. Have archers. Alright, let's send, uh... Let's put, uh, men at arms in. Yep, cool. Group two. Group one, group two. Let's go, let's knock out their gate. I'm pretty sure there's nothing that they can really do. Note the pretty sure. I can't believe that. Those archers followed me all the way from here. Up here, they shot me like twice here, and they followed me all across this <laughs> the wasteland. That's loyalty right there. Loyalty to the king. One. Okay. I wonder if he has. Does he have. Is he in Castle Age? Does he have murder holes? If he doesn't, then we're okay. And then murder holes. It looks like. I'm going to bring out Sid. Uh, archers won't help though, that's all. So I'll just leave them here, I guess. Yeah, hit him. That'll teach him for not researching murder holes. Wish I had a monk. I'll at least carry that with me, but... Join Mother Mead, destroy Alfonso's castle. Oh, you have to do it. Oh, it's probably a side object, because it's not the golden box, it's just a normal box. I don't know. Let's go, Siege! El Cid, we stand nothing to gain by fighting against each other. Let us call a truce, and each of us just go our separate ways. Uh, <laughs> That's what... Okay, yeah. 
Okay. I don't even, you know, you destroy his castle and he's like, yeah, now nah, let's be friends. You know, I don't want to fight anymore. It's like. Everyone here in the castle. We meet again, Elsie. We do. You could not have arrived at a better time. Oh, hello. Of Count Berenger is approaching our gates. Defeat him. You may have to land outside my city gates as you want. Nice. Let's uh go for their mangonels and such. We got our little rams here. Let's sit campeador. Running away right now. Get those swordsmen. Teach him who's boss. Okay, well that was easy, but I feel like there's got to be like a purple base, right? Like this can't be it. Otherwise, this is a pretty bad mission. <laughs> if this is the, if this is the mission, I suppose you've got to. There's a little bit of resource management. Like you've got to be, you know, you make siege to get rid of the castle. I suppose you could have just spammed out knights. No, nah, I don't think so because they would have hit you. Yeah. No, you need to make siege at least. And all of that stuff. Get rid of these pavilions though, because that is pop space. I am, you know, let's just get rid of the siege workshop now while we're here. We'll see, because if oh, this is all I have to do. Destroy Berenger's siege workshop. Wait, who is that? Nice. Thank you for saving my city. No it is a small reward for your travel. Thank you. Now you may use these villagers to build your own encampment northwest of Saragossa. Oh, here. I'm but be right. vigilant. The ringer may come again. Be vigilant. Right. We got some cow archers from. That's kind of cool. We've got some pikemen randomly standing here and looking menacingly. You know what, I'm not even going to risk it with El Cid because I know my luck, especially with these, like, X must survive missions. Okay, I have... Let's personally build a dock, I reckon. And then I'm just going to build a town center where his base was, just to add insult to injury. Let's have a quick just squeeze around here, eh? Let's just see what we've got. I'll delete that now. We'll get this um we'll get this up and then I can send some units out to fish at least at some point. We got Saracen, so we get better galleys, but I don't know if galleys is gonna help, you know. Let's just move down here and see what we have here, right? Any uh any cool stuff? I'm using cav archers to scout because they have better line of sight. I suppose I could build over here. Alright, let's get our um, siege back in here actually so I don't lose them. Alright, um, I am really don't see any other point. I should just build up here-ish. Anything here? Nope. Alright, cool. Um, I'm just gonna build here at the... near these trees. Alright, let's, um, not do this. Oh, wait, no, I have to. There's no towers or anything. Alright, then. Defeat Berenger. Alright, then. Monks! You camel stealing monk. Get him! I mean, look, we're beating him. Um, we probably will just go right into camelry and trebs back, back to the old Saladin days. What's that? That's one. 
But yeah, certainly is not a. Uh... Alright, we'll just get some more people in wood cutting. Bring them back. We'll just keep uh get some more fishing ships out then. Alright, let's get some housing out. Because of Saracens, we need to have nice block houses. <laughs> like back in the day. So back in the day it was what two campaigns ago, three. Uh, we've got archers. Uh, yeah. yeah. Alright, um, what I want to do is... Here, I'll put these units in here, except for... Make them group two. We'll do some scouting out here. We'll see what we can, uh, kind of find, eh? Nah, uh, but this town center's not very well defended. <laughs> Let's get some good, uh, good, some good house placement, eh? Oh, all that archer knows. Saracen real estate. Might be in trouble. But no, what was it? Holy Land. Holy Land housing, that's it. <laughs> I think I'm thinking of all the jokes I've made in. I suppose I could have come down here. Maybe. This bridge annoys me. Also, there's fish there. Very annoying. Alright, so now we're just going to have to build up Eco. Um, we've got... Um... I could bring, like, eight villages down here, and we'll have some safe farming. Might be the play. Ooh, gold. I can build another town center. Maybe we do that instead. We'll build a town center down here, so then we've got like a little backup base. On the off, I say off chance, on the chance that they're gonna absolutely come this way and massacre us. After that, we'll do some scouting over this way. But yeah, getting these uh, fishing ships out were definitely worth it, worth the effort. We get one, one more, I reckon. I suppose I can build some farms now, eh? I said A so many times. I swear I'm not Canadian. I know why I, just, I do it. It's like not even something I usually do, I don't think. I've never actually noticed, I'll be honest with you. Just making noise. Let's get another two up. Oh no, I can't get two up. Wait, who had? Oh no, Tootins had cheap. Never mind. I was gonna say I thought I had cheaper farms. Tootins have cheaper farms. All right, then we'll do this, and then you can be gold miners, I guess. And we'll just have to get some more people on. Oh, what happened there? Oh, we got, uh, yep, yeah, alright. Lost the cab archer, but you know what? We know that there's a castle there. <laughs> so really, the scout was successful. Task failed successfully. Alright, so he's up in this corner then. He's gotta be. If he's not there, I'll be very surprised. Alright, let's get, uh... Oh, he's not doing anything. Pop limit 100? Pop limit 100. Okay, so I don't need to build any more houses. That's kind of cool. Let's look at getting... Some of these up. He's soaking. He needs the love. Do you need it, though? Or you just want it? He knows. He knows what he's doing. They're slowly healing up. Alright, um, alright then. 
Oh, there's a monk there. Okay. And a bottom bud. Damn, this man does not play around. Looks like tribes. Alright. He heard. All right, he heard some people. He was like, "Yes, I need friends now." Oh, really? My dogs, my other dogs, not. Okay, and we're back. All right, I just was like, I'll just let them all out because they're going to uh, sit there and suck at me this whole time. We need, it really comes down to, do I wanna, I think we just go to Imperial, honestly. I might just go to Imperial. Well, I say, I say that like it's like, Easy. We'll just go to Imperial, you know. Easy. Oh. Okay. Already messing up farm placement. Uh, that's three. Oops. Alright, that is that farming done there. Let's get some farms up here. Wood cutting, not very OP. Rude. Uh, that's at least those four done. T into here. Get those monks and show them who's boss. Get those monks and show them who's boss. What is this monk rush they're doing? Are you kidding me right now? Right, we're getting the monastery up because they're just converting units at this point. Monastery. I got some archers. I think archers might be alright. Especially since most of they, they don't have mounted units, which I think is very weird for Franks. But I don't know if it's like they've changed the... You know how like sometimes they change things? This will be one more there, and then we can get some more farmers out. And then I think we're pretty well off. So. Let's, uh. Get some markets up. And I might even. At some point, when I get woodcutting upgrades, maybe. Alright, let's get some safe woodcutters going. Because I need stone. I don't know if I've walked past it. No, I haven't. Okay, so there's no stone out here, apparently. Alright, you're back to gold mining. Oh, I don't want to hit the wrong button. V. We've got enough for a castle, at least. Get treadmill crane. We'll get murder holes now. Gonna need more stone now. V for Vendetta. And we'll put a castle right there, I reckon. Nice, beautiful spot there. Alright, get rid of that and then we do that one. 
All right, we get this castle up. At least then we can get some Mamluks out. Mamluks being quite honestly OP. I wonder if we get this monk out. That relic's gone. Hmm. Well, that's rude. Okay. All right, we've got a good eco setting up. Get some more people there. Woodcut and upgrades. Love to see it. Um, let's get. Let me get the mining camp there just so I can research the upgrade. Get the fishing ships going. I uh, haven't got a blacksmith. And I'm pretty sure that should be all uh, stuff kind of done. At least all the buildings are needed. Uh, alright, a lot of rams. Let's go up here. People in there. What is this? Zealotry. Camel units have extra hit points. I'm not going to research it yet. I want to get right to Imperial and then I can think about everything else. I am either missing a farm or I've overbuilt. I've just overbuilt. Okay, let's build a mill because I will need a mill at some point. There. Well, since we're playing as uh, Saracens and we will basically be spamming out the glorious majesty that is. Oh, never mind. Let's just get all Imperial. The glorious majesty that is Mamelukes and Camels. Uh, I need one more villager after this. Beautiful. Alright, so that's pretty much our eco setup, I reckon. And then, oh, ballistics, beautiful. Uh, but mill, we're gonna get heavy plow ASAP. Put the wood cutting up right down here. Naam, Amron, Mustaidaton, Mustaidaton. Naam. All right, let's get some more safe wood cutting going. Banaaton, Banaaton. Naam. You and all these peeps here. You built that one. Beautiful. And these silly men at arms will have no idea what's going on. We also got, uh, we'll probably get some. Maybe we'll, we'll want camels? I wonder if I need camels, really. You know what? I never make petards. Probably for a good reason. Let's make some petards and see if I can actually use them. Uh, but we will be getting siege engineers when we can. What is that? That's food and wood. Uh, wood cutters, eh? Wood cutters, am I right? Alright, I made one too many. No, I just made one. Yeah. Alright, Petards, let's go. Let's knock out this gate. Really? Just really? I don't even know how many petards it will take out of gate. Oh, it takes three. Oh, that's beautiful. Now let's do just attack move there. No, there's nothing here. Okay. I'm scared now. I'm actually a little scared. Get our upgrades. Let's get chemistry. Inscription. A couple of trebs. We've knocked out the gate. Uh, what's a unit I won't use? We've got a knight here, let's go. Send him up. Because it's where's Saracens, we don't need any of that. But I reckon some trebs. Spam out some mams. I've got some of these too. I suppose I'll get these people to... We'll pair our rams at least. Alright, no military. Nothing here, no no defensive buildings. I mean there's a crossbow in there that is like whatever, who cares? There we go. Okay, so it's not like super bad. 
Um, if we get four? I'll shaft money, I'll rather that. What is that? Hello. Alright. I'll take you rooms out. Um, I can get counterweights. Yeah, there's a lot of ifs and buts there, though. Let's make some of those for now. We don't really need wood, so let's just get rid of all this fucking. Let's get a delete Mameluke up. Okay, so there's not really a lot here. Like, the uh, most annoying thing would be that Bombard Tower from the looks of it. Rightio, then, that's new. Um, yeah. I suppose I could make light cavalry to deal with them, but I'd rather not. Let's just get Imperial Camel. Wait, we have hand cannon here? I did not know Sarah. I mean, it makes sense, I suppose, but I just didn't think we did. Saracen's had hand cannon here. Um, look, in theory, Bombard Towers won't have. What's that sound? Chemistry on the arrows. Ballistics being OP. Animals being annoying. <laughs> oh, they have, they converted a mammal. That explains why all my units were dying so much. Okay, that makes sense. Um, yeah. Alright, gold mining somehow. I mean, gold mining, I have 10 here. Oh. oh, not too many. We only need nine, I think. Alright, we're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna have to build up a quick army up here now, it looks like. Uh, because I really thought that... Yeah, right. Uh, I'm pretty sure El Cid can take all this out. I'm pretty sure. I just need to keep an eye on him, I guess. Like, well, they're only doing four damage to him, and he's going to knock it out in three hits. Yeah, he should be right. And they can't really do much with him. They are healing him, which is annoying. I mean, they're hitting him pretty hard now. Uh, 76, I don't know. Nah, I'll, I'll risk it. Let's go. I we need to get some more, uh... Yep. And they're only doing one damage, I think, with that. Oh, they're doing two, maybe. I think they're doing two damage. Yeah, they are. Oh, I didn't kill him. There we go. <laughs> Once you do that... Alright, let's go in here. Alright. Look out the little silly buildings there. Let's get Zealotry. We've got Elite Mameluke. We've got Siege Engineers. I don't have any towers, so getting our slits is kind of useless. Oh, you come over here. Old mate up here is not doing anything. Dead farm there. Okay. 20, like, 20 on gold, and man, I forgot how gold intensive the Saracens were. I suppose we didn't start with any, like, things, uh, any stuff there. Alright, this is our main building here. Krebs, your group two. Rams are group three. Let's go. Um, I want to see if I can ram. There. 
Startup theater. Get him. Saracens raiding. Oh no, there's a castle there. I didn't see that. Hey, no. None of this. None of this. You s Monks are annoying. Uh, we got the rams here. We got uh, the castle's probably the biggest threat there. Let's get some more heavy camels out. Let's get some mamelukes out. Hey. Damn, that uh, that thing has murder holes and can hit me <laughs> hit them with a cannonball. That's kind of rude. All right, raid and pillage has started. Raid and pillage. Uh, let's get rid of this monastery, please. Well, that being said, this town center is about to go down, and that should be pretty much him out. All right, get, there we go. That was easy. All right, what do we get to? 38, not too bad. Motama, Lord of Zaragoza, was a gifted leader of men, but like many of the Moors, he was also a poet and artist. Classic. The cultural achievements of the Moors made the rest of Europe seem barbaric in comparison. As the seed parlayed with Lord Motamid in his sumptuous palace, he feasted on meals that came floating down the indoor street. Motamid bestowed rich gifts on the seed and made him a wealthy man. But the seed, ever the loyal servant of Castile, convinced Motamid to ratify a treaty, making Zaragoza part of Castile. The seed never fought openly against King Alfonso. Though he did make enemies with Count Berenguer and other Spanish lords who wanted only tributes of gold from the Moors, Classic. who were not interested in making alliances with them, Count Berenguer would remain the Cid's enemy for many years. I'd be annoyed too, the amount of camels I made just then. Alright, uh, return to map. Let's just have a quick look at the map here. Yeah, okay. So there is no stone. So the only stone is this little bit here, it looks like. Uh, unless I'm missing something right away, but it, I'm pretty sure there's no stone here. There's a sort of random Berenguer there. All right. Big gold here right next to the castle. I really thought... I feel like he could have been way more aggressive. We are on hard. Um, but yeah, that castle was really nice. Alright, so if you get a castle up, you pretty much win the scenario. Nice. Alright, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, we <laughs> revisited the Saracen tech tree, uh, which I actually like. I, I kind of miss it. I, I replayed it recently, just for the hell of it, and it was really fun. Alrighty. Uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you like. Uh, make sure to sub by doing all the campaigns on hard. Get nice gold medals, yo. And we're moving on to El Cid 4. The Black Guards in the next episode. I'll catch you around.